Hey everyone, hey brothers and sisters. Hey you listening, if you're not saved, hold on. I know this seems strange at times. I didn't make this stuff up. I'm just kind of reporting on it. I'm, just, I'm trying to tell people the truth. That is serious. It saves your soul to have faith in Jesus Christ. Yes, this is about Jesus Christ. Everything is. It's the meaning of life to have faith in him. So this is an update on Jack White, and I will say this. I've only known the Lord Jesus Christ since about 2015, 2015, 2016. I was at a time in my life where I needed to seek the truth. And I'll also say this, like, I play guitar. I don't play as much as I used to, but I like guitar pedals and fuzz pedals. I, I'm aware of Jack White. Like, I don't mind his guitar playing and his music and stuff. This isn't... This whole channel is not about, like, individual people. So I get this comment this morning. Hey, Jack White just uploaded one of your videos to his Instagram. And I'm like, okay. So if we go to Jack White's Instagram, the latest post he does is my video here, right? If you want to go see the comments here, brothers and sisters, you can go see that. It's upsetting because there's a lot of like, hey, where can I sign up to be in this club? And hey, hail Satan and all of these kind of things. And there's a couple people that are like, so you didn't deny it and stuff like that. Once more, Jack White, right? He's a famous person in our world. He's a musician. I want him to be saved. I don't like lies and deception. And this whole world is full of them. It's not just Jack White and everything. This is like all famous people. So I want to quickly show some pictures. This pose, I call it the slam dunk pose because it's quite obvious they're doing some kind of symbolism. And a lot of people don't get one eye symbolism. One eye symbolism is them doing the eye of Horus. Horus is an Egyptian name for Satan. All the false gods and religions of the world, it's a big branch of Satan. So he's covering one eye here because he's in the club, right? He sold his soul for rock and roll or whatever. I don't know how all this stuff works. There's a lot of people that are like, he sure knows a lot about Freemason. Like, I've done research on the computer in other places in the past seven years. Anyways. Do you see all these famous people? And it's more, it's regular people too, but famous people, musicians, artists, Select, like, whatever, actors, actresses. He's doing this pose here, which I'm trying to tell you. It's not because he loves Jesus Christ. It's the opposite. Do you see all these other people doing the same thing? Over and over and over and over and over and over and over again? Well, I'm not going to research this or anything. This guy's clearly crazy. These crazy Christians, stuff like that, right? They deflect. They got to do damage control. Because it's clear to see, for those with eyes to see, they're all doing it. He's doing more one-eye symbolism here. They like to take an object, like a flower, and darken one of their eyes utterly. That's in scripture. He's doing the eye of Horus again. Just like this person putting a rose to their eye, and other people putting things over their eye. Okay? Many people know, like, the portrait of Napoleon, and Napoleon was a Freemason, and he did what's called the Master of the Second Veil, or the Hidden Hand, where they hide their hand in their coat like that. Another thing being, look at me, I'm a Freemason. Do you see all these other people putting their hands in their coats like this? It's the same thing. He's, Malik Berry is putting his hand in his coat, hiding it, the hidden hand of a Freemason, the master of the second veil. They're standing with the Freemason checkerboard. Here's all these people wearing and standing on the Freemason checkerboard. I don't hate these people. I'm pointing this out so people go, that's what the world is? That's what these people have been doing? We need to humble ourselves and run to Jesus Christ before it's too late. This is 666. This one finger and the circle here makes a six. The second finger makes another six. This third finger makes another six. It's the AOK -okay sign. It's called like the sign of success in this world because all these successful people hold up the sign of success over their eye and to, the, to whatever, right? 
and everyone had a good laugh of me saying, here he is covered in blood, having some fun or whatever I said. I, I haven't watched the video that I did two years ago, but you know, again, I'm aware of Jack White. He's a celebrity in our world. He plays guitar and is known for that. I don't hate him. I want him to be saved by Jesus. A lot of the world is sold out. There's a series on YouTube called They Sold Their Soul for Rock and Roll. It's a saying as well as a series, and it's true. Like Led Zeppelin, if you play their record backwards, it's like all that stuff that people go, look at these crazy Christians. Please research into the world around you. We live in a biblical world. There's a lot of things that are lies in the world, and people... People go along with the lies because they don't want to bother reading the Bible or praying to Jesus or humbling themselves or walking the narrow path out of sin and the flesh and things of the world. So, God bless you, Jack White. I hope you find the Lord Jesus and repent of things. And you, brothers and sisters, thank you for walking with me and, you know, doing this. This is, this is still strange. I've been doing it for years. It's still strange. But I love the Lord Jesus. I have faith in him 100%. I know that he's real and true. He died on the cross for me and for Jack White. And for everybody that commented on Jack White's post today, he died for us because we're all sinners. We need a savior. There's one way. It's not religion. It's Jesus Christ. And the Bible's true. We live in a biblical world. God bless you, everyone.